Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel Alex here. So I'm in London at the moment. I just woke up and I'm about to hit the gym. I'm about to do some exercise and I've been thinking to do this video for a bit of time because so many of you guys you ask me in the comment section down below about this particular issue which is age. Can you become a flight attendant in your late 30s, let's say, or after your 30s? So if you scroll down to my comment section, many times in many of the videos, you guys are asking me this particular thing. Um, maybe some of you are over 30, maybe some of you are over 35, and you still want to become a cabin crew for one of those uh, Middle Eastern Airlines, right? Etihad, Emirates, Qatar, maybe some other airlines like Fly Dubai, Saudi, and so on and so forth. And you're wondering, okay, is my age all right? Am I still able to fly the world while being over 30? Can I get hired in one of those positions if I am over 30? And um, the answer to this question is, Yes, but I can only tell you about it uh, from my perspective. Um, as you guys know, uh, working in the Middle East is different than working in Europe, for example. In Europe, you can apply at any age, I believe, or at least below 50, you should be fine. But in Middle East, they have more requirements when it comes to that. They most likely want you to be younger in order to live abroad, to experience the new life, you know, maybe not being married. Those things, they, they kind of matter. And also being fit, being physically fit, the job is demanding. So as you age, it, it becomes a bit tougher. It becomes a bit harder, especially crossing so many time zones from uh, east to west, from north to south, you know what I mean? It's quite a demanding job physically um, and of course mentally as well. So it might be more fit uh, towards the younger uh, towards the younger population, let's say. And a small example by that, oftentimes I can compare being jet lagged with being drunk. If you are younger, you can handle the hangover much easier. If you're older, the hangover starts to get a bit a bit tough, right? <laughs> But nevertheless, so can you be uh, older in those airlines? Yes, I personally met uh, colleagues of mine that started at around age 35, 36. Quite a lot of colleagues nowadays, uh, at least in, uh, in my airline, they are above 30 and most of them, I mean, quite a few of them, let's say they have previous airline job experience. So if you're above 30 and you have previous airline experience, that's a big point. That's a big bonus. They actually want that. They search for that. And um, I think that it's generally speaking an advantage, right? And nowadays, I believe Etihad is the airline that hires the most amount of people over 30. At least from what I've seen for, from the other airlines, for sure they hire the most amount of people over 30. Now, okay, some of you asked, uh, what if you are over 40? What if you are over 40 and you want to become a cabin crew in one of those airlines? Well, obviously it's going to be tougher, but it's not impossible. Like I always say, even if it's not already there, if it didn't happen yet, let's say, um, it's not impossible. And I believe it may have happened. I think maybe we have some colleagues that are over 40, they got hired, but I'm not sure. I haven't met anybody personally. So I can only speak with, from my personal experience, from the people I've met in the, in the job, right? The new joiners flying. I meet them, I talk to them, this is how I know, right? This is how I form my opinion. My opinion is based on what I see uh, within the airline. So yeah, keep trying. That's what I always say, um, just push for it. Just go to those interviews, prepare your suit, prepare your tie, prepare your skirts, right? And uh, try and uh, you never know, maybe you get that chance. Also, if you are interested to become a cabin crew, you should also consider other airlines. There are so many good airlines out there and everybody seems to be looking for a crew nowadays. So pick your battles, 
uh, take a chance and go for it. I'm gonna go to my gym session right now. My water is prepared. It's freaking 9 p.m. and I slept for most of the day. This is London flights, ladies and gents. Airbus A380 London flights. Plenty of them. I'm going to go ahead and do my gym session. Let me know in the comment section down below what you think. I know many of you guys, you want an exact answer to this uh, issue with the age. Uh, my answer is always try and try more. That's it. That's, that's the best thing I can tell you. Just uh, give it a chance and try, right? Now, thank you very much for watching, like, subscribe, all of that good stuff. And until next time, see you guys on the next one. Bye, bye.